Welcome to another fun video of the Explorer series. I'm Vivi and we have another special friend with us today. Hi, I'm Kate and today we are going to have another fun watch and play time. Okay Kate, let me ask you a question. What would you do if you were exploring in the forest in the night and you couldn't see anything? I don't know, but I'd be very scared if I couldn't see anything. Mm -hmm. And that's the same for adult explorers too. And that's why every explorer needs to carry a torch with them no matter where they go. Would you like to see the explorer torch? Yes, please. All right, let's get it out. Mm. Now, before we start playing with the torch, there are some safety rules we need to learn. A torch is a very useful tool that is used by policemen and firefighters all the time. But we must always follow the rules. The first rule is that we never point the light directly into someone's eye. The light can be very bright and sometimes it can hurt your eyes ah, if you look directly into it. So never point it at someone's eyes. The second rule is stop using the torch if it gets wet. Ugh. So if you drop it in a puddle or if it gets very wet from heavy rain, please stop using it until it is checked by an adult. That is because the torch runs on electricity and it's not safe for you to play with it when it gets wet. The third rule is to always ask for help if you're not sure. The torch needs batteries to work and if you're not sure where to put the batteries or how to put them in, please ask parents or other supervising grown-ups for help. There we go. So, what are the safety rules again, Kate? The first rule is that we never point the light directly into someone's eyes. Mm -hmm. The second rule is to stop using the torch if it gets wet. Stop using it until it's checked by an adult. The third rule is to always ask for help. If you're not sure, please ask parents or adults for help. Mm -hmm. That's right. Well done, Kate. Now. The 8th Colors Explorer Set Torch is special because it has a built-in signal to ask for help. To activate the help signal on the torch, we would need to switch it on 5 times. Let's try it out together. Okay, switch it on 5 times. 1. Switch it off. 2. Switch it off. Three, switch it off. Four, almost there, switch it off. And five. The rapid blinking is a Morse code, sign for help. That's right. This is how to signal for help with the torch when we're in trouble. Can we try that again? Sure. Switch it off and one, switch it off. Two, switch it off. Three, switch it off. Four, almost there, switch it off. And five. I did it. Yeah, you did. Now, let's have some fun with the torch. <laughs> okay. Now that we have learned how to signal for help, it's time to have some real fun. I think you're going to love this, Kate. What are we doing today? We're going to do shadow puppets. Yay! Let's set up our torch. Make sure you have a surface to put the torch on. Then, take your torch, put it like this, and make sure it is facing a blank wall. 
After that, switch it on. Does it have to be dark for us to make the shadow pop up? Yep, that's right. All right, dim the lights. Great, thanks Kate. Now that we have everything set up, let's get to making some shadow puppets. To make a crab, put one hand on top of the other and spread your fingers and then wiggle your fingers as if a crab is scuttling away. To make a bird, make sure both thumbs are kissing each other. Your fingers have to be together, not spread apart, but together, and then start moving them up and down to make the flying wings of the bird. To make a crocodile, Put one hand on top of the other and then curl your fingers to form the teeth. Jump, jump, jump! Jump, 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 jump! It's easy to make a bunny. Just hold up your fist in the air, stick out two fingers, and then you're ready to hop. Hop, hop, hop! have for today. Good job, guys! I can't wait to see what other animals and sea creatures you'll come up with. We can create almost anything. Yes, we can. So don't forget to create, celebrate, and stay great! Bye!